on we're on okay a little bigger I'm a bit of chill can I I used to choke bike for a while. <laughs> okay. Today I'm rocking it at old school. Yes, on my wife's XR 125. <laughs> oh shit now. <laughs> it's so weird. I haven't driven a bike like this since, well, God knows how long. Years ago I had a DT125 which was a uh, 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 a two stroke Ooh. but um <clears throat> but I never had a little four stroke uh, one two five it's uh it's weird it feels so strange i'm uh if you're wondering why I'm on this thing today a couple of reasons one my k t m is in the well it's about to go in the garage, I just washed it today. It's in, the, it's in my garage, but it's going to go into the garage. It's having a, a new... Uh, it's having a new piston and barrel because of the oil leak that's been constantly... been the constant problem with it. It's been burning oil, it has. The last had 300 uh, kilometres on it and it used uh, 700 cc's of oil <laughs> so you can imagine that's a, a tad excessive so anyway that's going in so uh, but the, the main reason I was I'm out on this is because uh, I when we first bought it you know went over it had a little spin and uh, to see you know what was if there's anything needed doing to do into it before my wife got on it and it seems okay but I wanted to take it on you know a little bit of longer spin just to check that everything's uh, hunky-dory I'm actually going <clears throat> I don't know if any of you have watched any of my other videos but um, I am going to, s to see this there was a set of stairs in one of my videos that was just kind of there just stuck there and I went past the, the uh, well a similar place the other day and I noticed I think they're finished so I'm gonna go and have a look see if see what the hell they look like and what they're up to gives me a chance to come out and this little beggar <laughs> <laughs> the one thing about a bike this small, you can't ooh, be pulling out in front of people. What's that say? 16. Okay. Uh, it's amazing to think that when I had a little one two five like this, I used to get done for speeding all the time. Well, done by the police. Ridiculous. How the hell I managed it. Deal. I think I was meant to go that way actually. I think I'm the wrong way. But where am I? I will not be <laughs> will not be caught up by this bus. I will not be caught up by this bus. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, oh, is this it? I think this is it. Is this it? Or oh, is this the wrong one? Uh, no, it's the wrong one. Okay, this is definitely the area. 
Oi. There she blows. Over running a bit still, aren't we? Stop it on the only goddamn hill. So this is it. A ruddy huge piece of stairs. The Mayor Burgermeister is Rudy and he said let's make a ruddy big set of stairs. <coughs> it's got a light on it. Must light up at night. A steep pair of stairs. Set of stairs rather. There's no pair here, is there? It wobbles like mad. <laughs> oh, that's weird. Other than the calculations, right? <sighs> How cool is that? This, ladies and gentlemen, is Belgium. I can see my house from here. No, I can't. Oh, it's weird. <laughs> okay. Hey, look, here's my bike. There's a wife's bike. <laughs> do 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 do, do. That's the one thing about driving this bike everywhere. Everything just seems happier. I know how noddy feels now where he wears that stupid hat. It's just like, I feel like waving at people. Like a hello. No, there is something nice and relaxing about driving this bike. It's just like, I'll get there, you know, in my own time. Relax. Take it easy. Ah. Oh, let's see what happens. Eh? Take the Mrs. Bike off road. Do a bit of off roading on the XR. <laughs> it's actually not bad. It's got trail wings on. I wouldn't want to be on this grass with the. Uh... The thing about this bike is it's so quiet. It, uh... It's so quiet and, you know, nobody even hears it coming and going. I think people just have a different, you know, <laughs> this bench is a bit soft. So people just have a different, you know, when it comes along, they're not like, oh, bloody hooligan. You know, they, you know, it's, the engine sounds quieter than most lawnmowers. You know, it's, <laughs> so it just, I think it, it's, it's one of those bikes that brings a smile to people's faces. Everybody smiling, it's sunny. They got the shorts on, it's all going funny. Do 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 Look, I'm even doing Dakar style standing up. I love a small eggs on these. Feels like my feet gonna fall off. Incoming! I don't want to go home. I only came out to. I only came out to look at that. Our little stairs. This is so much fun driving this thing around. I feel like getting myself one. Then me and the missus will be one of the biggest problems with my my 690. If I go on my 690, oh, and I go out and uh, the bandit, you know, I feel like I'm just constantly waiting for her. You know, it's like it, it doesn't bother me. You know, if I'm wrong, I'd rather her take her time and you know and enjoy yourself and. But I wouldn't have much if I got if I got something like this. I wouldn't have any power to, and I'm enjoying it. 
two wheels to two wheels at the end of the day that feel of freedom you get it's what i remember about my first dt my first bike i had was a dt125 you know i used to cycle everywhere and then all of a sudden i got this dt125 good grief that was an amazing amount of feel about a freedom yeah overtaking in a blend it's not the greatest idea yeah you go where you want it's just i literally drove that every day i'd come home and i'd be like okay where am i going now i go to see somebody and i'd be like okay where am i going now i just go everywhere on it it was most bodacious doesn't she look lovely all nice and shiny Shiny.